What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode. Just got home from a super awesome weekend at the Real McCoy Ranch. We took about, I don't know, like 10 animals this weekend. It was an awesome time and this is one of those uh, clips that I wanted to show you. Um, also, I wanted to let you guys know that the 4B caps are in stock on the website as well as the shirts and the bait. Anyways, we hopped in the blind and we were looking for an axis doe and Dylan from Rock Bluff Outdoors, he ended up connecting on a nice axis doe and then it got dark on us. So just before, actually just before it got completely dark on us, we jumped out of the blind, went down the Sendero, looked and saw where she was laying. She didn't go but 30 yards maybe. So we come back to the blind and we look down the other Sendero straight ahead of us and we see some hogs. And the only camera that I had on me um, it was convenient and easy to access and already on my tripod was this camera that I'm filming on right now. Unfortunately, it wasn't my night vision camera, so the shot doesn't look the greatest, but I'm gonna go ahead and play it for you guys anyway just because it was so much fun. And I love stalking hogs like these in the dark. Um, I just love, whether it be in an open field in a sendero or in some brush or whatever, I just love stalking hogs and doing it after dark makes it a whole lot easier because you can blind them with that, with your light and sneak up so close to them. Um, I think I ended up being about somewhere between 15 and 18 yards whenever I shot this hog. He, there's a small little boar, he ran about probably 50 yards at most, piled up, and we got him drugged back up out of there and back to the buggy, loaded him up, brought him back to camp, Got the whole thing skinned out and quartered up, thrown in the cooler, and I got some breakfast sausage now. So I'm gonna grind that whole little hog up into some breakfast sausage and throw it in the freezer. It's gonna be awesome stuff. Guys, I'm, ex I'm super excited to show you the, the next video after this because we do a tour of the new lodging going up at the Real McCoy Ranch. And it will be completed and ready to go by, we're shooting for Easter of 2020. So of course, it will be ready by hunting season next year. And as of right now, we, we uh, the whole reason why I went down there was to guide a hunt, or guide a couple of hunts actually, got some guys and we had a great time those videos will be coming out as well so you guys can um, see those in the next few days we were extremely successful and we it seems like we always are whenever we go to the real McCoy um, I have had some extremely difficult hunts there though going out for black buck and axes and, and things like that but um, we were 100% successful this weekend it was a great it was a great time and so if you guys want to book a hunt all the information will be down in the description below so you guys can just look at all that and if you would like to book a hunt my email is down below in the description as well and you can uh, click on my email shoot me an email say hey um, you know ask about dates animals prices all those kinds of things and then I will get back to you um, normally I'm back to you or I reply back to you within two hours or so sometimes it's immediate sometimes it takes me a little bit to get back to you guys but anyways my all my information is down there the Real McCoy information is down there and then the website is also down there so you guys can pick up some awesome merchandise and some, some cool gear. Rep the, rep the brand and um, I came out with these, you guys know, but I, um, I wanted to mention these again. Um, these are the blaze orange and the black in the back and so I wanted to show you guys these um, one more time just by themselves. Um, this is for all you public land guys and for me as well because I'm fixing to be doing some public land hunting. and. I've had this public land stuff like planned out forever. Like since the early this summer, I've started planning out some public land stuff. So I'm excited to go do that. And I will be wearing my orange 4B cap. So I just wanted to let you guys know about that. 
And if you guys do have any questions about hunting a real McCoy, drop um, drop a comment down below with any questions, and I'll or you can email me either way, and I'll get back with you guys and um, hopefully. I'll see you guys out there on the ranch because this weekend I had some subscribers come out, had a great time and hunted and they were successful like I was saying, but it was cool to get to build like a, per a personal relationship with some of you guys and, and film some hunts and um, if you want you guys can be in a video. I enjoy that. I really, really enjoy that and I really enjoyed my weekend at the Real McCoy and there's lots of videos coming up as well and so you guys don't want to miss out. Um, be sure that you're subscribed so you get to see the rest of the week's hunts. And also make sure and hit the notification bell. That way you get a notification every single time that I upload. Um, as soon as I get done filming this video, I've got another really cool one that I'm fixing to start for you guys. And we're doing something different. So also stay tuned for that one. You guys are awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to all you new subscribers. There, I mean, This stuff's just growing super fast right now. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave me a thumbs up. And also be sure to share the video. And let's get it out there as well too. so we can let everyone enjoy some some hunting footage and some uh, some good times on the ranch so all that being said I think I think that's about it I think that's all I got um, you guys are awesome thank you so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow